Hello, everyone. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you doing? How are you doing, guys? <clears throat> okay, nice. Well, we're gonna start tonight. Oh, hello, David Alejandro. Oh, you're on the way. Okay, okay, no problem. You're on your way. I don't know whose problem is that. Oh, okay. Hello, Marilyn. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, Cecia. Welcome. Tell me, welcome to your class, Grecia. Hello, teacher. Hello. I'm sorry, I'm having a lot of trouble right now with this thing. One moment. I'm trying to. I'm trying to do everything correctly. One second. Okay, there we are. Welcome everyone to your 13th class of module two. We are going to continue with the present continuous tonight. And we have a lot to um, talk or learn about because in grammar, there are a lot of rules, are a lot of um, um, exceptions, right? But the best part here is to speak. Okay, so we are going to center this speaking. So um, let me call the roll and then we are going to start the class. Okay, Alba Janet Lopez Avalos. Present teacher. Okay, Cecia Gemima Perez Fideos. Present teacher. David Alejandro Choto Martinez. Present teacher. Okay. Here we go, oh my God. Del mi Isabel Dera Sarguero. Okay, Daisy Carolina Sánchez Nieto. Eva Leticia Contreras Argueta. Grecia Tatiana. Um, Grecia Tatiana Rosales Campos. 
Juan Diego López Palacios. Present teacher. Linda Alicia Valladares Arqueta. Luz Verónica Trujillo de Urbina. Present. Marco Adonai Villeda Alvarado. Mayra Yanira Alfaro Posada. Melida Isabel Bonilla Ventura. Néstor Ariel Garzona Asensio. Present teacher. Okay. Pablo Alberto Magaña Molina. Present teacher. Patricia Eugenia Navarro de Rosales. Roxana Marilín Pérez Ortiz. Present teacher. Okay, thank you very much. Just let me see what's going on with my video. Oh, okay, there it is. Yeah, every time that I touch the tab key, uh, it um, makes like a false uh, circuit over there. So it uh, quit, right? It's it. Uh, it is, um, it turned it off, it, it turns it off, okay. So there we are, okay, Grecia, I checked you in already. So let's continue now. We are going to start tonight by introducing the class. Just let me go there. Who wants to tell us what was the last class about? What was the topic we were studying? Do you remember? Mm -hmm. Yes. What was the cl last class about? Uh, the last, mm -hmm. the last class uh, was about the present continuum. Okay. The, old, uh, all the rules. Okay. The rules of what? What rules? What rules did we study? How to write, right? How to write verbs with the ing at the end, right? Because yes. we need to know about the spelling rules. Okay, it's not for us to speak because when you speak, you just say the ing at the end or the um, uh, y ing or it's like automatic. But when you are writing, you you have to make sure that you are writing correctly. So that's what we have to study: grammar and spelling. Okay. At the same time that we are learning to speak and to learn some expressions, right? Okay, then we are going to continue tonight with the present continuous WH questions. Do you know what are the WH uh, questions? Have you ever heard about it? 
WH question? Yes. Yes, I hear about it. Okay, what are they about? What are they? Yes, what, why, when. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's a type of questions that uh, requires or request information. Okay, these questions are not to just <clears throat> affirming information that we know. Uh, we are looking for an answer when we ask these kind of questions, okay? So um, let me take you to the goal for tonight. The goal for tonight is that you as participants will be able to ask questions about uh, questions using present continuous and about things that in your job are ongoing, okay? That's what we are going to do tonight. We are going to learn how to ask questions, but not only to ask questions, but to answer those questions, okay? So let's go to our agenda for tonight. And tonight we're going to have a little um, a feed a short feedback. And we are going to remember a little about the grammar and the spelling, okay, of the ING verb forms. And also we are going to um, talk about some uh, things that we have already learned along the course, okay? Then we are going to talk about the future events. Remember the question, what are some events you have scheduled for these and next week? We are going to write an email describing activities. Then we are going to set an understand the structure of WH questions in these tense. These tense is present continuous. And the session one-on-one -on -one for tonight is Marcus turn, okay? It's Marcus time. Marco Adonai Villeda, is it there already? Because when I called the roll, he wasn't here. Okay, Luz. Uh -huh. No, yo no puedo ver la pantalla que está compartiendo. Teacher, me, me, me too. I can see that. Ni yo no puedo ver la pantalla. No okay. se puede ver la pantalla, teacher. ¿Desde qué momento? ¿Desde el principio? Sí. Uh, cinco, este, cinco minutos. Okay, todas, todas las slides que pasé, oh my God. Okay, I don't know why, because I was, I was sharing my screen. I, was, you, I can try to say you, but you talking about the weird word. Oh no, please yeah. tell me. You stop me that, and then yeah, you tell I me. That you were just explaining. Oh, no, no, no. I was showing, uh, you know, the introduction of the class. So is it okay now? Can you see the screen already? No. No, I don't see. No, teacher. No, teacher. It says here that I am... Um, oh, what can I do then? I will stop sharing, okay? And I will do it again. Maybe I'm going to do it in another way. Okay, oh, because it's too much. Okay. Let me see, is it okay now? No. No, we can see. No. No, teacher, I can see.
Okay, now? What about now? No. No, teacher. No, no teacher. It's just recharging. What about now? A mí se me solo me sale inglés corporativo empezó la función de compartir pantalla y está como cargando sí. únicamente. Eso yo, mismo me parece a mí. Ah, bien. bueno, entonces no es cuestión de acá, de mi, de mi lado. Ya le di por todos lados y dejé de hacerlo, lo volví a hacer, dejé de hacerlo, le di por otro lado, lo hice de otra manera y no, tampoco ustedes no lo pueden ver. Dice. Entonces sí. no es cuestión mía, es cuestión en la red, ¿verdad? Ok. Eh, yo ya me salí, teacher, y volví a entrar para ver. Eh, si eso era, pero no es igual. No, ok, no. si hago yo lo mismo va a suceder. Si yo me salgo y entro, va a suceder exactamente lo mismo. Ok. Um, well, what I'm going to do right now maybe will be to send you the pictures. Ok, so I'm going to send the pictures. I okay. will. Ok, I will okay. take the picture and let me go to the WhatsApp. And here we are. So this is the first one that I showed. This is the first one that I showed. Okay. It's low, the WhatsApp too, guys. But there it is. I sent already the first one. And the, the first one was about the topic, only the topic, the present continuous WH questions. Did you receive it? It says phone not connected at the moment. Okay. There we go. Did you receive it? Did you have it already? No. Okay, well, I sent it through the WhatsApp, so let me see <coughs> the other ones. Okay. The problem is that here <coughs> I cannot send them all because my Um, okay, ya tengo la, la, la imagen, teacher. Do you have the image? Yes. yes. Okay, through the WhatsApp. Through the WhatsApp. Okay, great. So there it goes, the next one. It's the objective for tonight um, that we were talking about the present continuous and we want to uh, learn how to use or how to ask questions and answer questions. Okay, so there okay. it goes, the objective. Okay, done. <clears throat> Then the next one, I will send it, the next, I will send the next one. It's the agenda for tonight. Okay. And the session one-on-one, -on -one, oh, it says it doesn't answer here. One second, here we go. Okay. There we go. Okay, there you are. And the last that I am trying to share was the agenda, right? We were uh, talking about the agenda and we read it already, okay? Um, so the warm up. It's Q, uh, questions and answers feedback. Then we are talking about the future events. And the question is very important for us to know how to answer. It is what are some events you have scheduled for this and next week? Uh, to do, uh, in order to learn that, we are going to write an email describing activities <coughs> that will be our first class work. Then uh, we are, Uh, we will study the WH questions structure. Uh, in this case, we are uh, studying grammar, okay, grammar. Even though we are going to um, set some expressions that are more common, right, using the WH questions and also, and also how to answer those questions. So let's continue with this and let me, entonces voy a usar, chicos, the, el pizarrón. Vamos a ver si se puede ver el pizarrón, ¿ok? Ok, teacher. 
So here it is, the board, the board. Here it is. Okay, then we were saying that there are two kinds of type, I'm sorry, two kinds of questions. We have direct questions. And we have also information questions. Okay, information questions. Information questions are the WH questions. But to know where they are coming from, okay, we are going to start with the direct questions. What are the direct questions? Do you know what are the direct questions? Do you know what are the direct questions? ¿Cuál podría ser una pregunta directa? ¿Sí saben qué es una pregunta directa? Do you know what is a direct question? Como cuando uno pregunta a la hora, no sé. Okay, when you ask uh, or request for the time, yes, it will be an information question because you are not just confirming, okay? You are requesting for some information. So that, that cannot be a direct question. Uh, I mean, a direct question. Uh, in that case, cuando nosotros preguntamos la hora, es una WH questions. ¿Y cuál es la pregunta que hacemos? What time is it? Correct. What time is it? Okay. So we ask what time is it? And we use a WH word. Okay. But we were saying about the direct questions. Cuando hacemos preguntas directas, son preguntas nada más de confirmación de la información que ya sabemos. Por ejemplo, En español, nosotros eh, tenemos preguntas que son como obvias, pero al mismo tiempo son como de confirmación, ¿verdad? Eh, por ejemplo, yo le puedo decir a alguien, eh, va, me preguntan a mí, ¿eres chelita? Sí, claro que soy chelita, o sea, ¿verdad? Pero eh, mi respuesta no va a ser así. Es una cosa obvia, es una cosa nada más de confirmación, ¿verdad? Que quizá por teléfono, no sé. Me preguntan, ¿eres chelita? Para que yo me describa, ¿verdad? Y entonces, ¿qué le Sí, yo soy chelita, ¿ok? Es como una eh, confirmación de la información. No me están pidiendo otra información fuera de lo chelita, ¿ok? Esas son preguntas directas. Por ejemplo, me preguntarán a mí, uh, are you 28 years old, <laughs> right? Then yo le, yo le voy a decir, uh, well, near, near, right, around 28. <laughs> okay, okay, no, right, no, I, I'm really <laughs> older than that. But we are going to say yes, yes, no. Pero es una forma de una pregunta directa, ¿verdad? Entonces, pongamos esa como una pregunta directa y veamos cuál es la diferencia en este caso. ¿Ok? Are you, um, let's say, uh, a teenager? Yo los estoy viendo. Are you a teenager? Are you a teenager? ¿Cuál sería la respuesta en este caso? No, we aren't. Correct. No, we aren't. Ok, great. Good. Esta es una pregunta directa. Solo estoy confirmando que ustedes no son, ¿verdad? Porque yo lo veo, yo sé que no son, right? But are you a teenager? Well, no, we aren't. Ok, no, we aren't. Uh, le podríamos preguntar, uh, are you paying attention? Ok. Are you paying attention? Yes, we are. Okay, yes. there you are. Yes, we, sorry, we are. Okay. Estas de arriba son preguntas directas. Las preguntas que solo se usan como para confirmación. ¿Y cuál es la estructura? Ah, va el verbo to be al principio. Luego lleva el sujeto después del verbo be, ¿verdad? 
Y luego, en este caso, que estamos hablando de el presente continuo, ¿ok? Aquí no hay presente, este es un presente normal del verbo to be, ¿ok? Esta primera que vimos arriba, are you a teenager? Pero la segunda sí es una de presente continuo, ¿verdad? Um, entonces, ponemos la forma del verbo ing exactamente después del sujeto, ¿ok? Y luego, pues, el complemento. Esa es la estructura de una pregunta directa. Then, what will be the uh, structure of an information question? Ah, uh, then we are going to, right? En este caso, tenemos una expresión doble H, WH, ¿ok? La información es completa. What time? Aquí no hay un sujeto, ¿ok? El sujeto viene hasta el final, ¿verdad? Este time no es el sujeto, o sea, no lo vayamos a confundir ahí, ¿ok? Sí estamos hablando de que queremos la hora, ¿bien? ¿yeah? Pero se une en la expresión, en la expresión WH. Entonces, podemos decir que WH questions at the beginning, ¿ok? They start with WH word. Or with WH phrase. Okay. WH word or a WH phrase. Okay. For example, what department do you work in? Uh, what company do you work for? Okay. Um, what is your name? Es una sola palabra. What company? It's a phrase. Okay. Puede, puede ser una sola palabra, WH, o puede ser una WH phrase. Ok. Bien. Esto es como eh, una introducción realmente a lo que vamos a ver ahorita. Pero antes, antes vamos a hacer algo muy importante. A ver, yo creo que es el momento justo, justo para... Ok. Vamos a ver. Please grab a pencil. Grab a pencil. And please save your books. Save everything that you have. Your notes. Everything. Ok. We are going to have a surprise quiz. Ok. A surprise quiz. Pero de todo lo que hemos visto. Ok. Un examen de todo lo que hemos visto vamos a hacer. Ok. ¿Están listos? Yes, no, it's a joke, guys. This is a joke. <laughs> no, no, I'm not going to do a quiz right now, okay? This is a no, joke. Problem, hey, no come, problem, on, problem. come on. Problem. Ahí sí pusieron todos atención, ¿verdad? <laughs> no, Un examen no va a ser de todo lo que hemos visto. Ok, ajá, ajá, a ver si se hubieran visto la cara que pusieron, vamos a ver, por lo menos los que estaban con su cámara encendida. Ok, hoy sí, ya están todos listos. El examen era un chiste, ok, uh, it was just a joke y era para atraer su atención porque sí siento que estoy muy solita acá. Ok, creo que es por los slides que se me distraen, ok, porque estamos en blanco tal vez. Pero sí, vamos a hacer algo muy importante. Recordemos las reglas de spelling. Sí, a ver. sí. sí. Eh, eh, no sé si solo soy yo, pero tampoco veo la pizarra. ¿Y los demás? Yo no, no la yo, veo. Eh, yo tampoco. No la veo. Pero si ah. la clase la puedo recibir aquí, sí, sí. Oh my. Yo solo veo. Yo solo usted la veo, Tisha. Oh, 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 oh. La veo en el video y la veo su foto en grande. <laughs> I would like to have a board right now here, but the space that I've got is really, really um, reduced. Uh, so I cannot have a board right here. Okay. Uh, but let's try. Let's try. Maybe I can copy this. No, I cannot copy this. Let's see, let's see, let's see. 
why is that happening? Oh. ¿Saben qué? Si probamos que yo me salga y vuelva a entrar, probablemente, probable. Ok, teacher. Puede ser, teacher. Porque ya llevamos 25 minutos y ustedes no han visto absolutamente nada de todo lo que he dibujado, hasta, hasta chirulitos y les puse emojis y de todo y se los perdieron. Bueno, ok, vamos a ver. Hoy que estaba tan emocionada en la pizarra yo. Ok. Um, ¿Qué podemos hacer en Stereo Pat? Ok. You know what I'm going to do? Please. Uh, Mayra, do you think you can share your screen with us? Can you share this, your screen with us? Just to test. Todo. Mayra? No le entendí. Uh, que si puede, por favor, compartir la pantalla. Teacher, yo estoy compartiendo ahorita. No sé si logran verla. Sí. Sí, 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 sí. lo veo. Sí, lo la vemos. La Ajá. Okay. Sí, sí. Ok. Uh, pero mi. Um... Ahora la veo. Okay. Ya la quité, ya la quité. No, ¿sabe qué voy a hacer? En este mismo instante, para que salgamos de, de el atolladero, voy a pasar uno en blanco, solo los de la clase de hoy, y usted me hace el favor de irlos pasando, ¿sí? Ok. Ok. Casi, casi está listo. Casi, casi. Okay, it stopped. One more second. No, tal vez ahí solo si finalizamos, fíjense, porque igual no. Es Let's muy try. grande. Uh, okay. Cerremos y volvamos a entrar. Sí, probemos de esa manera, porque es demasiado grande el documento con los slides. Para enviárselo tengo que irme al drive para poder hacerlo. No salimos entonces. Uh, permítame un momento. Vamos a poner aquí el nombre. Uh, Mojol 2. Solo déjenme hacer esto. Ok. Ok, yo creo que ahora sí ya lo tengo en el drive. Vamos a ver. Oh, no. Vamos a tener que hacer eso. I'm sorry, guys. Bien, voy a finalizar la sesión y volvemos a ingresar. Ok, nomás salimos, hacemos el intento de volver a entrar. Ok. Ok. Y si sí, esa que está ahí se ve. Sí, pero esa es de Mayra. Por WhatsApp. 
Hola. Sí, esa es la suya, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Ajá, la que me mandó por WhatsApp, que están intentando, pero no sé si esa era la, porque hay, hay otra. No, ya estaba en el pizarrón, estaba en el pizarrón, no podemos usar ah, las funciones de la, de, de la, el ajá, la explicación que estaba dando, ¿verdad? Correcto. Ah, ok. Entonces, déjenme finalizarlo y nos vemos en un, min, un minuto, ¿ok? Está bien. Okay. Okay.